Next this hour, a rocket has hit a bus travelling from the city of Donetsk in eastern Ukraine, killing 10 people and injuring 13 more. The airport in the city that has been the focus of army assaults for months now has also come under intense shelling this evening. Here's our correspondent Maria Finoshina with the details. Uh, you may find some of the pictures in her report disturbing. We received pictures from RT's video agency Raptly. The camera is targeting Donetsk City Airport that has been at the epicenter of the fighting for months. And as you can see, the shell is quite intense. I spent many weeks in eastern Ukraine, in Donetsk, in other cities, in Donetsk Airport particularly. And from what I can see, I can say that it is a very heavy shelling. Earlier today, on Tuesday, we heard that 10 people were killed and 13 more, at least, according to different sources, up to 18 more people were injured after a shell hit a bus uh, in Donetsk uh, region. We still receive contradictory reports about who was controlling the territory, the area through which the vehicle was traveling. Uh, but there was a Ukrainian army checkpoint near the site of uh, the shell, uh, where the shell landed. And uh, right now, as usually we witness, both sides are blaming each other. All this at the time when we see international efforts to bring peace to this part of the globe. And earlier on my Monday, we heard Russia's foreign minister saying that according to uh, the sources at the foreign ministry, Kiev could consider military solution to this crisis. Well, unfortunately, it looks like still this place remains very dramatic and the situation there remains very tense.